Welcome Libras. I am back y'all with another video. So yeah, let's hop into it guys. Let's see what what's coming for March. We got some jumpers already. <laughs> we got some jumpers. Let's see what's going on for Libras. What's going on for Libra? What is going on for the Libra? Okay, what's going on, y'all? Be sure to comment below. Let me know what's going on in the comment section. If you're new, welcome. Love, light, and energy over here, y'all. Please subscribe if you want to catch more videos. All right, so we're going to hop into this. We're going to hop right into it because it's, it's some stuff going on here. So at the bottom of the deck, we got the three of wands and the moon and the nine of wands. Okay, so I see you waiting for something to... I mean, it was done in the dark comes to the light because we got the sun card here and the moon okay so what's done in the dark definitely is getting ready to come to the light if there's somebody being sneaky lying doing has ill intentions cheating it's getting ready to come to the light okay it's getting ready to come to the light i see some spying going on so i want to definitely look into that because i in the past i do see a lot of conflicting energy here okay so the five of wands is here so there was a lot of a lot going on Recently, why is the page of swords here? The Hierophant could be a Taurus, but um, I see either a Taurus could be spying on you, or you could be spying on a Taurus or a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. But I see disappointment, being upset about a decision here with this Four of Cups and this Two of Pentacles. Okay, so not being too happy about a decision. That's what I'm picking up. Tell me more about the Hierophant. Justice. Okay, so there could be a... Someone could be legally married. I'm picking that up. With Justice and Hierophant, that is giving off like legally married. Okay, so somebody could be in a marriage, but it's falling apart. It's ended, it ended or it's ending. Temperance just jumped. Okay, so you could be dealing with a Sagittarius. Maybe you're looking to see if someone is going to balance or fix the, a marriage or a, some type of commitment. Okay, now we got the Nine of Cups and the Chariot. It could be a Cancer, but I see like wanting to move forward. Okay, so I can see you wanting to move forward, but something here is draining. Why is the Ten of Wands? Maybe you want to see if someone is going to do the right thing. But yeah, Tower. Tower and the Ten of Wands. I see you being completely exhausted. Okay, exhausted here exhausted because i feel like and i'm even seeing like three of swords energy there's some type of pain or sorrow here let me know about the three of swords the will of fortune i'm seeing somebody has a change of heart okay somebody has a change of heart here somebody has a change of heart I see lots of regrets and frustrations here as well. And it's in regards to a love situation. We got the lovers. I told y'all the truth is getting ready to be revealed. Okay, so there's some type of clarity. You could you could be getting some type of clarity. The the what's crossing you is the Queen of Swords. And the Queen of Swords, she's coming to get clarity. She's coming to get the truth. Why is the Queen of Swords here? And she's not playing around. She's not gonna be nice about it either. The moon. I told you. The challenge is there are there's some type of secret. Okay, there's some type of secret. So let's see what we get. Somebody could you could feel betrayed once you find this this um this secret out. But I do see that there was some confusion going on in the past. So let's take a look at this first. Let's 
six of wands. So somebody was more concerned about winning an argument. Somebody was more concerned about, yeah, there was lots of confusion. Somebody was more concerned about winning an argument than actually getting down to the bottom of something. Somebody more so wanted to win an argument. Yes, I see you stop communicating with this person. You and this person aren't going to be in communication in the near future. I see someone walking away. So you could be walking away. And on your on your journey, looking for something new. Ace of Wands. You find out some type of truth, okay? You find out some type of truth. Maybe you could find out that this person is already in a connection, okay? It's something here about finding out the truth. Tell me more about this Ace of Swords. The Eight of Swords. This has you in your head a lot within the next few days, okay? You could be in your head a lot. Could be a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Um, but I, I feel like you find out some you find out the truth that there's a third party, three of cups. There's someone new in the picture. There's some there's a third party here. And I see, you know, regrets, regrets around a decision, around a lover, choosing someone, okay? Now, the person that's external to you, somebody's getting tired of waiting. Whoever you are dealing with, they were, got tired of waiting. Could be a Leo. We got the strength card here. Somebody's tired of waiting. Someone could even possibly be pregnant. So somebody possibly could be tired of someone waiting to tell someone else that there's a possible pregnancy here. We got the devil here. Um, could be Capricorn. We got the high priestess. This could be Pisces energy. But there is a seven of swords energy here. So this person that's external, they got tired of waiting for the truth to come out. So I feel like this person brings you some type of clarity. Why is the hermit here? I'm getting sing I'm I'm hearing said that there was a single man. Someone lied and said that they were single and they were not single. You may find out that the person that you may have suspicions about, um you gain some type of clarity. You find out some type of truth. You find out some type of truth. Yeah, I, I see some frustration, okay, surrounding this. Surrounding this. And I see you cutting off communication with this person. Yeah. They are going to be trying to reach out to you. Um, but I see you cutting communication off and moving forward, okay, and moving on. This person could be out. Could, uh, this person could live at a distance from you. Could be a cancer. I'm picking up a long distance relationship.